for the fans of Marlin, ticker Pond. Here's the weekly, daily, and four hour and one hour chart analysis. So here you see that the initial pump here, we got a correction and found support on the ME50. So we're bouncing back. We are a little above the MA50 for Marlin on the weekly chart. It's still bullish, it's still good. Nothing to panic at this stage. On the daily, we see that we have this downtrend here. And we have this channel. So we have this downward channel and we bounce back at the ME200 and we're charging towards the upper band, the upper part of the channel. Be careful here because for this coin, we could actually correct and continue downwards. We need to stay at the same level and try to break out this channel in order to change the momentum on the daily chart. So daily chart is bearish, weekly chart is still positive. So this is the four hour chart. You see the big volume here that allowed us to bounce back. We could say that we almost got rejected here, but you see here that the ME 200 of the four hour is exactly at the same level as the trend line. Therefore, is it acts as resistance. And as you saw here, we touched it, rejected, came back a little bit, touched it again, rejected hard. And found support here here again we touched it got back and here we didn't even touch it but we already have a little correction so be careful I think it's a little too early to come back to Marlin but we're trying to get to the upper level for this coin And on the one hour, we're still a little more bullish. The last two hours, the last three hours have been bullish, except for the last one, which we are still having a little correction. If we go to the downside, then it's continuation of the trend line. If we charge towards the resistance, then we could have something positive for Marley. I hope you enjoyed this video. I'm going to try and do four hour and one hour analysis for those who uh, trade daily or shorter time frames. Let me know if you like that type of content. Ciao.